topic for this lesson is design concepts and under design concepts you will learn about the elements of design a design concept is the original plan conceived in the mind of the artist on how the outcome of a pattern motif or decoration will look like when completed so basically before starting up a design the idea you conceive about that design is known as design concepts so now let's get to know the meaning of elements of design elements of design are different parts that the artist combine together to make a good design and they are also referred to as the fundamentals of design such elements include line which is also known as points shapes form texture value and lots more so now we're going to explain line line is a part of a moving point and line is also the fundamental basic element of art there are endless number of lines that we see and use in art but technically there are two types of line which include straight line and curved line the rest of them are combination or variation of these two types of lines when it comes to line styles we can group them into four categories first we have solid or continuous line second we have interrupted or broken lines dash lines dotted line tire marks footprint they all would fit into this category next implied lines these lines are not actually there but you could see them as a border between other elements a good example of implied line is horizon line it's not actually there but you can see it and lastly psychological lines psychological lines are not actually there but you can see it they show direction they are generated by our minds based on other objects psychological lines are used by artists to create an area of interest in an artwork it's also a very powerful tool that is used in compositions and graphic designs here are the four line styles we have the solid line interrupted lines implied line and psychological lines now let's discuss on shape shape and form they are actually the same but the only difference is that why shape is two-dimensional form is three-dimensional shape is an area that is flat or objects that are two-dimensional y form is a defined space that has depth that is three-dimensional in visual arts shapes and form are defined by other elements of design shape can be defined by line shape and line they work together shape can also be defined by value that is making an area lighter than the other area or making an area darker than the other area shape can also be defined by color shape can also be defined by texture or by changing the pattern shapes can also be defined by other shapes by assembling them together to form one shape there are endless number of shapes and they can be classified into two categories which are the geometric shapes and irregular shapes or organic shapes geometric shapes are precise and they also have specific names like square rectangle and so on and geometric shapes are also man-made shapes organic shapes are irregular and they are found in nature and most of them do not have a specific name these shapes are also curvy and free-flowing for example the shape of leaf another element of design is texture which is the tactile quality of a surface 
In three-dimensional art, texture is actually the way something or an artwork feels when touched. While in two-dimensional art, line, shape, and value helps us to actually know how an object feels. Under the type of texture, we have the implied texture, which is the illusion of having physical texture. That is, by seeing it alone, you can easily tell how it feels if it's rough smooth or soft we also have real texture which is the actual variation upon a surface it is different from visual texture that is you have to physically touch it to know how the object feels